our immune system reacts slowly to new infections and much more quickly to infections it has seen before. Its memory resides in white blood cells called memory T cells, held for years in a dormant state. When another immune cell alerts them that it has encountered a cell infected with a virus or that it has become cancerous, the memory T cell activates to form cytotoxic T cells, which then hunt for the diseased cells. Once the cytotoxic T cells have fought back against their targets, the majority of them die, with a few returning to a dormant state to maintain the memory of the threat. Sometimes an activated cytotoxic T cell doesn't die when it should. Instead, it becomes dormant. It grows new surface molecules and loses its activation proteins, making it unresponsive to signals from its target pathogen. As these dysfunctional cells accumulate, they increasingly take up space in the immune system so that populations of healthy normal T cells cannot develop and expand to take on new threats. But what if we used a vaccine to destroy the unresponsive cells, leaving the healthy cells intact? In one sweep, we could restore the immune system's ability to fight viruses and cancer.